Hi, we are Ong Jin Holdings IT Consulting Business Department. We are SAP Business One vendor located in Seoul, Korea. This video is a demonstration of the CTM add-on that we provide to our customers. CTM stands for Clipboard to Metrics. Basically, CTM provides copy from Excel and paste to SAP Business One programs. You can paste to both metrics and grid. I will start the demo. Okay, uh, the add-on is already installed. I will start the add-on in the add-on manager. Okay. Okay, now it's running. And first, you have to set up the settings. So you go to tools and CTM settings. And when you open the CTM setting, you will see short key and continue when error occurs. The short key is basically paste key that you usually will user will use to paste the data from the Excel. So the default setting is control O. And you can also use the brackets and F2, F3, and F5. So you have six options with the control. And without control key, you should be able to use from F2 to F12, all the function keys. So it's a, uh, it's up to you that decide what to use it. However, uh, we suggest control O and it's a default setting. Okay. And the continue when error occurs. This option is basically, uh, SAP business on screen has a, it's, a, uh, it's validation function. For example, a uh, price field must be entered with the uh, numeric data. However, in the Excel, you might have a uh, character. Uh, user made a mistake or something. And then if this function is on, it will skip that error cell only. And then it will keep pasting, continue pasting to the end. Okay, I will save. And... Uh, it's all set up, but before you use it, you go to views and system information, turn it on, and it will show you uh, which column the unique ID, you can see the, uh, all the unique IDs at the bottom of the uh, screen, so you know which column you're actually getting it. Okay, now uh, let's enter sales order. Okay, uh, you can uh, normally customer first. So I'm just gonna enter this customer. Before we paste it, uh, you, we have to have a data in the certain format, right? So uh, we will, this CTM provides automatic Excel template. So you right click on the matrix. And then you will see CTM format settings. <clears throat> and when you click it, it will give you the, uh, all the column options that you can select. So all these available columns are showing. And then you select the columns that you want to use the uh, copy paste. So I'm going to select uh, item number and quantity and price and warehouse and the delivery date so all these five columns that i'm gonna use it and then click export and it will open the excel automatically and it will give you the uh, template and the first row is basically the uh, column description it's not uh, usable data however it will just give you the uh, it's kind of like an indicator that user can see. And the second row is unique ID of the column. Now I'm just going to generate some of the sample data.
and these items that I'm going to enter 200 of them Fifteen hundred each from this warehouse, and the delivery date is uh, July thirty first. Okay, and now uh, I'm gonna state create some more data here oh good okay and I'm gonna change some of the quantity so you can recognize it the lines now okay the first row is just title so you just skip it then from the second row you copy it so you copy from cell A2 to E10 in this case so you go to the matrix and then click control O and the CTM will work and then now there now as you can see uh, the item number and quantity and warehouse delivery date is all there entered okay now uh, we're gonna add see if it actually works and now sales order is added and let's find the sales order we just entered there you go okay and now we'll go to uh, add-on program which is developed by another vendor and uh, we'll show you it also works for other vendor developed solution so this program is a very basic input screen using a UDO okay as you can see this is the input screen and then we're gonna enter class and then class go name okay now you do the same thing to the uh, ctm format setting and then the column select the columns and then click export then you generate data or copy from data you already have I'm just going to create some data here. Okay. Now, uh, you copy from the second row, just like we did. And then, you go back to the matrix. And then, Control o There you go very easy to use and let's check the data okay so you copied it from the Excel a very good advantage of this tool is it supports any screen in SAP Business One not just core not just add-on that developed by us but also and any other add-ons you already developed or your vendor already developed so you can use this tool for uh, any type of screen in within the SAP Business One so um, email us for questions and more information following this email 
and thank you for watching this video.